Hello from Yes Queen channel. Thank you very much for watching our channel. And in today's video, I would like to introduce you to some lesbian terms. So, um, I work as a consultant, and you know, um, I work with different kind of industries. And every time, you know, I realize that my clients from you know different different industries like telecommunication, PR, sports events, automobile, etc. You know, they have their own terms that they use, and. Um, after like I realized that oh I like women that was the same thing you know I mean there are some certain terms <laughs> that are used so um, today I would like to introduce you to some some words with you so um, I'm gonna start now so um, the very basic terms um, let's say based on um, the clothes that they wear behavior or attitude you know um, one woman could be seen as more masculine or feminine. So, uh, if uh, a lesbian woman is more like a masculine, then she would be seen as butch lesbian. And if a lesbian woman is seen more like a feminine, she is called as a femme lesbian. So, um, I myself am a femme lesbian, and my girlfriend is also a femme lesbian so we're like a femme femme couple and um, the most famous example of botch femme relationship would be Ellen, De Ellen DeGeneres and Portia De Rossi so Ellen is more like a botch type and Portia is more like a femme, uh, femme type so yeah I mean yeah I love I love I love that couple yeah so adorable yeah they love each other so much and it's so nice to look at them yes so now I introduce you to like butch and femme and under the butch category and under femme category again there are tons of different cut different categories so I would I would just pick one from each okay so uh, one from femme lesbian lipstick lesbian so if a woman you know likes to really like dress up as a you know woman a woman and likes to wear makeup then um, she could be called as a lipstick lesbian, like me and my girlfriend. Yeah, I mean, now she got her hair short and, I mean, I think I even prefer her, like, with her short hair. And, I mean, every, I mean, she rocks any hairstyle anyways. I mean, she's so beautiful. But, um, anyways, um, she still likes to wear, like, makeup and, like, really nice dresses. So, like, we're both, like, lipstick lesbians. So, we're, like, lipstick lesbian couple. And, um... Uh, the example uh, of the celebrity would be Stella Maxwell from Victoria's Secret. And the opposite of lipstick lesbian, you know, under the under the category of butch lesbian, um, there's a tomboy. And um, the example will be Kristen Stewart. I mean, I don't need any explanation, right? I mean, who doesn't know Kristen Stewart? <laughs> and also um, Ruby Rose. I mean, so many women went crazy, you know when she was like, you know, a guest star on Orange is the New Block, right? <laughs> so, um, you know, there's a tomboy and lipstick lesbian. And um, I would also like to add another term. So between masculine and, between masculine and feminine, between butch and femme, um, you know, there's a middle and it's called androgynous. So the example will be El Erica Linder. And I mean, the first time I saw Erica, was Katy Perry's video unconditionally and such a beautiful video I mean so it's supposed to be the lyric video so I mean there are no much actions you know they're just like um lesbian couple behind the lyric and it's more like I mean in that term it's more like a butch femme couple but I mean they don't really you know make any moves or act you know, they don't really say anything but like the facial expression of Erica was so emotional, you know, I was so moved. So, I mean, if you haven't watched it, please Google or YouTube search and Katy Perry unconditionally, you know, it's unconditionally lyric video. I mean, it's so beautiful. I love the song, first of all, and I also like the video is so, so beautiful. So, you know, sometimes um, me and my girlfriend fight. <laughs> And 
during our fight, I sent that video to her. Yeah, I mean, we are a femme femme couple, but still, you know, it's like a lesbian couple and loving each other unconditionally. Yeah, like that. Yeah, that's my concept. Yeah. So anyways, um, you know, like, I like women, um, but, you know, I, I even didn't know, like, uh, lipstick lesbian or botch, you know. I mean, I, I learned these terms after I realized that I like women. You know, and how I learned these words were like from women, from my heterosexual friends. So they were like, I mean, when they found out that oh no, Mary likes women, they were like, hey, so like you're the lip, Mary, you're the lipstick lesbian, or like, hey, so like do you like the butch type? And you know, when I heard these terms, I was like, oh, what's lipstick lesbian, and what's butch? You know, and now I know because you know now I am in this, like I'm experiencing this. You know, so I mean. The interesting thing is that even some certain terms are familiar to you, it's not they're not familiar to some other people at all. So I think it's in, it'll be interesting to share these kind of words with you. I mean, yeah, because I mean, yeah, <laughs> they, I would like to communicate with so many kinds of people, and also um, I would like to keep uploading these kind of videos. You know, like because like they're short, so it's like it's easier to shoot and edit and upload so like I can upload more vi videos more often and I can communicate with you more often, you know, so I mean, of course I would like, to, I would still like upload some kind, some other kinds of videos, but you know, I would also like to keep trying these kinds of videos as well, so um, thank you very much for watching our channel and if you liked the video, please click like and you have, if you haven't subscribed, please press subscribe, so Thank you very much and see you very soon. Bye!